Hospital officials with Henry Ford Health System uh, are focusing on the importance of comfort. 7 Action News reporter Simon Chowdhury shows us how they consulted with former patients to help future patients. The Henry Ford Health System is debuting their Cancer Pavilion. Now, for those who are walking through those doors, they may experience some of the scariest moments of their lives. And for those who are once in that same position, well, they worked with hospital officials to improve the experience for those who are battling cancer. It was devastating, of course. Deirdre Moody was 45 years old when she was diagnosed with cancer back in 2015. She found a lump during a self-exam and was in disbelief when doctors told her she had stage 3 breast cancer. I still didn't think it was cancer because cancer did not run in my family. Deirdre got a second opinion at Henry Ford's Cancer Institute. After two surgeries and months of chemotherapy and radiation, Deirdre is cancer free. But her journey doesn't end there. As a survivor, she wanted to help others walking through the hospital doors. So she joined Henry Ford's Patient and Family Advisory Council. We had an opportunity to uh, discuss what a cancer patient needed. From the beautiful artwork to comfortable chairs to the food, even asking for more windows and a huddle room. Family members can get together, have a discussion or even have prayer. Deirdre and other survivors helped shape the new cancer pavilion located across the street from the main hospital in Detroit. It opened last month with Deirdre ringing a symbolic bell. Really listen to our patients and um, uh, patients like Deirdre and so many others who came and helped us in these focus groups and told us what was important to them. Dr. Ben Mofsis helped take those ideas and turn them into reality. Beyond the aesthetic, hospital officials worked on providing better care for their patients. In addition to technology that can cut down on treatments, they are also bringing in specialists to the patients instead of the other way around, which could add stress. Big believer that when we think about personalized medicine, we need to also keep the whole person in mind. We want those patients to be thought about, that we're gifting you with this great thing, this great opportunity to be somewhere really nice and in the city of Detroit. And Henry Ford Health System is also offering patient and caregiver support along with yoga classes and music and art therapy. I'm Simon Chowdhury for 7 Action News. Wow, what a beautiful story and a wonderful way to give survivors of cancer a voice in their surroundings during treatment. So very important. Thank you, Saima.